James Henry Beard was one of the most successful portrait painters of the mid-19th century. At 16, he paid $2 for four painting lessons and began painting portraits. He was an itinerant painter traveling to Pittsburgh, Louisville, New Orleans, and Cincinnati. He married and settled in Cincinnati around 1830. He opened a studio earning a reputation as a portrait artist and genre painter, depicting ordinary people doing ordinary things. The Long Bill is one of these paintings. It was a time of nationalism. Its citizens sought art that represented their democratic ideals, focusing on concerns and common subjects with sympathy and humor. The Long Bill was painted in Cincinnati in 1840. Beard is commenting on the dependence of rural citizens upon the shopkeeper and inflation. Notice the January 1st, 1840 date in the ledger. Inflation was the central issue in the 1840 presidential campaign. The customer may represent Ohioan William Henry Harrison, whom Beard supported. He is the common man dressed in shabby clothes, trying to make sense of his lengthy bill, a theme recognized by many. The shopkeeper's stylish dress and sophistication is bearing the bad news. He is New Yorker Martin Van Buren, whom the popular press pegged as a dandy that supported the political machine of New York. The Long Bill and the North Carolina immigrants were among his early work. They were on exhibit at the National Academy in 1846 and sold for $750, the largest price said to be paid for any American painting up to that time.